I'm serious, Miles. I heard this dude can turn you And he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh now a good time? Oh thanks, King. Oh You're gonna make me cry again. Man. Okay, I made I made that joke in the first episode of 19 Inches of Venom, but some people don't know what I'm talking about. It was PlayStation, was it UK? They made a tweet, get the 19 Inches of Venom statue, and that's where that meme came from. So, I, I don't mean literally, okay? <laughs> hey internet, it's Jessica, and welcome back to Spider-Man 2. In the last episode, we met Harry, and he's okay, but you know, it's kind of foreshadowing Venom and stuff, so we'll see how that goes. But, uh, Mr. Negative and Scorpion have been broken out of the raft and have been taken by Kraven. And I don't know what he's planning on doing, but he has more people that he wants to take. And Spider-Man, specifically Peter Parker, is on that list. Hey, Miles. Get used to hearing that voice. Oh, Uncle Aaron. Dropped you a pin. Want to come through? Hey, Uncle Aaron. What? Too busy to visit your fam? Nah, I was just giving you space after you got out. Don't need it. Besides, we gotta settle some things. We do? See you soon, kid. Okay, I'm, I'm actually really curious. Is, see him and get it over with is the Prowler gonna then be like a part of this? Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big. Yeah. I feel like it's against his will, though. Like, Lee and uh, Scorpion against their will. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Another oh, day, no. Another disaster befalls our beautiful city. <laughs> yeah, what he really has to say. <laughs> In what should have been a routine prison transfer, the Spider-Men felt the need to inject themselves into a situation that was already being handled by the proper oh, shoot. authorities and completely botched it. No, he could do that. A group of mercenaries made their Wait, I'm stuck. Hang on. In the hijacking of the supervillain Scorpion and Mr. Negative. Not much is known about this new collective other than their pension for animal skins. But one thing is abundantly clear. Spider did nothing to impede them. Had law enforcement been allowed to do their job, these criminals There's more. wouldn't be in the wheel. Looks like we have an eyewitness calling in. Color, you're live. Hi, Jonah. Thanks for having me. Just want to point out that what you're saying is a total lie. <laughs> I love that everyone always calls them out. The it's the team. best. Law enforcement was completely outmatched. The Spider-Men saved countless lives and almost stopped those bow and arrow geeks too. First, you're lucky to be alive. Second, let me ask you, just this week alone, can you guess how much property damage those vigilantes- That's what I was talking about uh, last time no. too. But that's not the issue here. I don't have time to get into a circuitous whataboutism argument when there are costumed criminals reducing our city to rubble on a daily basis. <laughs> Think of all the shipping delays we're gonna face because of this. When you can't shave because your favorite cream is trapped in shipping hell, make He's sure He's probably talking about himself, though. Time for the bureaucrats to do their job. We need action. And also, a word from our sponsors. <laughs> All right, where's Uncle Aaron? We really Aaron? gotta do this with the mask on? Oh. <laughs> Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. <laughs> Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Kid? Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. But he does because he we feels so much guilt. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. 
Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? That's the thing I'm wor wondering about, too. Is he being honest? Behind us. <laughs> getting some? How did you... Hey, Miles. That Lee business? Don't be stupid. being sincere <laughs> legitimately I'm serious miles I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs leave it alone now what else is going on how school college you like <laughs> I don't know Haley so <laughs> like he just hang up and I'm like yeah okay now I know you you have a little crush all right. Here's the building. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. I My eyes. I put code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. Uh. Okay. Oh, L2. Wait. Sorry. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Oh. Don't Wait. cheat. Take your time. Oh, gotcha. Done. Not bad, kid. Another gate. This is kind of interesting. It's working on the PS5 adaptive triggers, that's why they're doing it like here. this. So what am I supposed to do? Oh. You would have made a decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside. Now. He would, right? He would be such a good prowler if it wasn't bitten by a radioactive spider. Almost as if it was in another universe. Hmm. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? Old suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Oh. Could definitely use this. Thanks, Uncle. Okay, so new suit. Ooh, health. Suit, suit techs. Okay. Oh, so it upgrades both of them. Okay, I thought it was just going to be like to each their own. That's pretty good that it's both because that helps out a lot. <laughs> Listen, this isn't the only stash. Unk. Whoever freed Lee sounds like my tech is right up their alley. I want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Yeah, okay. so there's gonna be more around the city I that you. I can get. Coordinates are in the mask. Once again, I'll try to get as much of the Don't side stuff afraid. as I can. It's just the, the one thing I, I love about, about this game that you have so much to do, you know? Oh, yeah, Miles. Oh, Mom. Oh, Thought of being. Hey, estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. Y cómo está él? Está tratando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Aww. Let's head out into the city. See I do like that on. he speaks both Spanish Maybe and English for this. It's really I'm cool. It. Oh, there's Avengers Tower. Miles, come up there. Remember? You on your way? Oh, right. Oh, yeah. Today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. Oh, yeah, we and need to get there. He's talking scholarships. I have so many he he for. needs to be he there for so this. Oh, my God. I love... I love the web wings. They're so useful. You know I left my backpack around here somewhere. Okay, let's get it. All right. <laughs> oh, 
I was about to say, are you not gonna change? <laughs> Hey, Miles. What's up? Hey, good to see you. All right. Now to be a normal student. <laughs> Man, I can't believe Mr. Atlas is going to be here at BV. Maybe one of those scholarships has my name on it. That's if so... he likes my sound. I really hope it does. We'll see, though. But I really love how balanced the story is between Peter and Miles. Like, you can... You can tell, like, there was pu there, they put a lot into the story for both of them, which is really nice. So I'm, I'm excited to see how this will go. Newton's Cafe. You think I can interact with, like, the booths? Maybe? Information Center. Dude, I feel so old. I remember doing these when I was younger. <laughs> New reproductive technologies are on the horizon. Check it out on this brochure. Cool. We've got preventative contraception information. Please consult your parents and your primary care physician. They'll help you find what's right for you. That's yes, pretty those cool. Are free. Remember uh, to stay safe. That's good. That's good to teach them about that. For real, though, I'm being serious. That's actually really cool. Miles, glad you made it. Oh, hey, Mr. Sinclair. Oh, hmm. I just love seeing all this innovation in action. Oh, have you heard about the chemistry club? They're filling in while Miss Ferguson gets ready to demo the new robotics drone. She's running late. Presentation's on the main stage. Oh, okay. yeah. I'll try to make it over there. Enjoy the show. Thank you. Thanks. See you around. That's cool. We can look at everything. Green thumbs. Hey, over here. Okay, hang on. I'll be there in a second, Genki. If it isn't Morales, the music master. What's up, Delisa? You here to see that university rep, Mr. Atlas? Yeah, definitely. Nice astronomy booth. Thanks. You should stop by later. I made a 3D model of Saturn. But get this. <laughs> it's cake! <laughs> I'll give you a slice. Hmm, thanks. Cool, yeah. Give me that cake. Let's see what else you got. Water filtration, that's cool. Ooh, snacks! Nice, I wish I could get one though. Visions Club, let's see. Visions Arts Club. And then what is this one? Oh, it's just the Newton's Cafe. Okay, anyway. Hey. <sighs> you made it. <laughs> oh, so we made it on time. Perfect. I want to talk to him about that computational physics program. We got your missing person report half an hour ago. What happened? That's just it. We don't know. We left to get something from her car and then never came back. Are they talking about the teacher? I just heard two words, missing in person. So I'm gonna say yes. Go ahead. We'll save your seat. Thanks guys. This cannot be good. I gotta catch up to the principal. Maybe I can find out more. Okay, I can't go this way. Wait, can I go through here? Yeah, I knew it. Do you have any of her personal items? Yeah, she left her phone behind. Is it unlocked? Have you seen any texts coming in or anything? What's with all those Spider-Man plushies that I keep seeing everywhere? I think that's a collectible. Notifications from her fitness tracker. It's counting her steps, wherever she is. The students adore Miss Ferguson. I hope she's all right. Please find her. We'll do our best. Miss Ferguson's Ferguson is missing. Oh, man. I wonder Sounds why. Like she's still wearing her fitness tracker. I wonder if I could find that signal. All right. Dude, I Let's swear he's gonna miss his chance with is. um the counselor Last again. Location, Dawson Harbor. Dawson Harbor. All right, let's go. 
Beginning text-to-speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles, Mr. Atlas just got here. That's so ETA. cool. Oh, man. Gotta See what I told you? First. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Get one for uh, him! Can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Sent you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And Thanks, hurry. Haley. She's got to be around here somewhere. Better do this quietly. Okay. Quietly? No, oh my gosh. Camouflage! Oh, okay. Can wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work. And he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh, now a good time? Oh, thanks, Genki. But now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi, Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. <laughs> Great. That's so awkward. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. Defeat the criminals in... Oh, God, Come? that's what I'm supposed to do? Okay, hang on. Uh, well, I used to do music production, but it's been hard to find time lately. Genki here showed me some of your samples. How do I Good do stuff. this, like... Particularly your song called Swinging. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and thinking. <laughs> and the tune just kind of came to me. Interesting. So awkward. And can you tell me about what's important to you in life? Okay. Being there for people when they need me. Being reliable. Trustworthy. Someone people can depend on. Very interesting. And finally... Why do you think you'd make a great addition to our school? I don't give up. And, uh, I care about doing the right thing. And I won't let you down. Fascinating. Well, Miles, thanks for your time. Oh. I think I've got enough here. Thanks. Uh, do you want my email so we can stay in touch, or, uh... Ooh. Uh, that See, that's the thing that's so scary about better. doing applications like that. Maybe I can make it back to BV in time to meet Mr. Atlas in person. And clarify some things. <laughs> Lights fading. Ah, get out of here! Okay. Much more left. These guys. Danger. That was way too close. Oh, there's another guy there, no wonder. Hang on, hang on. Hmm. Oh, <gasps> no! Oh, come on, damn it! Well, I tried my best, guys. Where's the other guy? Hello? All right. With those guys out of the way, let's see where that tracker signal leads. Like I told you, I worked for Rand Corporation, not Oxford. What makes you think I know anything about the RTX 35? It's the same six steps. There she is. This glass looks pretty breakable. We'll have to do okay. the hard way. You kidnapped me and tied me to a chair. I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's Rand? figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. Time to squash the spider. You're dead, Spider-Man. He's ours. You hide. I've got these guys. Hello! Oh, it's not, it's not reloading! Oh, shoot. What the hell? Here comes 
There's like too many of them. Messing up my operation, spider brat. Your operation involves kidnapping. How am I supposed to let that slide? For real, I'm spider. Ow! Found you, Spidey. <gasps> oh no, not me dying now. Come on. There we go. Okay. Got him. Ah! Oh my gosh. That was close. I almost died. <laughs> okay. I don't believe it. You took them out by yourself? It's yeah, I'm Spider-Man. Ready to go? Are you going to carry me? Yes, ma'am. Sure. I've carried people before. As long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you, you won't sue me. <laughs> Consider this confirmation. Just try to tell a brother first. <laughs> Oh my god, that's funny. But I also like, you know, when you're swinging, you can feel the weight when you're carrying. I felt the same way when I was um, rescuing uh, to Jonah. Our treasured James Jonah Jameson to the hospital. Is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. Hey! You are always welcome. Oh, yeah, that, that's a. Uh, Thank that you. as well. And now, back to the quad. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. Haley. How'd the interview go? It went. Went good? Try not to not worry. You've got to figure this out. you got time to figure Hi, this out. I appreciate 14 days. To interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So let's do this right and meet this week on campus, in person. Oh, at least he got in. Okay, that's good. So he's got 14 days. Oh my gosh. Got a few app requests popping up on BB's campus. Thought I'd call you directly. I can afford a new suit? Sick. Whoa, that's a new one. Hybrid suit. Ooh, I wonder what else we can get. That's so cool. I'm gonna oh, save and see if I can get two. I can't do this alone. Ah, someone's asking their special one to homecoming. But it looks like things got out of hand. Did they overdo it like Why one of those gender reveal things? <laughs> that was less dramatic than that. I think it's kind of sweet. Yeah, you're right. Okay, on my way. Nice going, Vijay. Bit off more than you can. Seems like you might need some spider help. Yeah, I had everything planned out. The clues, the screens, the art, the people, everything. Oh, Costumes. sir, I think you Perfect. got a little oh, overboard. Okay, I got you. Can you explain a little slower? What happened? <sighs> okay. I want to ask someone to homecoming, but he's special. I couldn't okay. just do flowers or chocolate. I got some screens, and I want to light them up with the message, but the generator's busted. Hey, I can fix that! It out to me, won't answer. What a scam. I think I can help. Thanks. I rented the generator from Reynolds and Company Rentals. I'll send you the address. On it. Alright, let's help this kid out. It's asking a date to homecoming. <laughs> Makes me wonder if Miles will ask Kaylee up to homecoming. Generators are going for a lot these days. Oh. This baby's ours. You understand? Okay, we That's have an no idiot. That's no ordinary rental transaction. No. Okay, let's see what we can do. Maybe I can take them out quietly. This is all 
the tree. What the hell? Jesus! All right. That takes care of these guys. I should check on the salesperson. Thanks, Spider-Man. Glad to help. Your client asked me to look into a delivery delay. I guess we got our answer. Yeah. About that. I'd love to deliver this thing, but those idiots already did so much damage. If she's salvageable, it'll take weeks of repairs. Mind delivering the bad news for me? Can do. Better call Vijay and give him the bad news. Oh man. I hope we can help. Here. Well, it's news. <laughs> Generator's busted. Wait. Okay, I'm not out of ideas yet. Just come back. I've got something else in mind. Okay. Kind of wish he said that earlier, but then again, he wouldn't save this guy, would we? Wait, where is he? Oh. Since the generator's no good, does BB have any backup ones? I know they keep generators on the roof, but... They're all overpowered for my setup. We'd blow a fuse. Unless we find something underpowered. I should be able to pick up that low voltage frequency. And your electrical powers would fill in the rest. Theoretically. Worth a shot. Or a shock. <laughs> I've got a friend who <laughs> okay. would love that joke. <laughs> yeah, Genki would definitely like that. Anyway. All right. Found a generator, but it's deactivated. See? That should work great. Mind giving it your special... spark? Got the voltage we need. Now we just gotta route it to the ground floor. Okay. Yes! I knew you'd figure it out. So how do Maybe I could connect these power nodes? I was gonna say I have to connect it to the other ones. Okay. The power seems to be traveling through an old circuit. So it's down here. Hang on. Ah, here we go. Yeah. Maybe I should go into electrical engineering. I mean, he could, right? With his powers? Oh, can I not reach out? Thank you. A million. You're welcome. Oh, maybe you should call yourself the Great Electric Spider. Thanks. I e like Spider-Man. Yeah, we'll just stick to <gasps> Spider-Man. Just got a text. He's on his way. Uh, don't go just yet. What do you I want me to do? Your help. Just hide. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, there he is. Vijay's texting me. What? A whiteboard. <laughs> oh, Vijay, what are you up to? Wait a sec. That's the equation he helped me with on our first date. Aww. <laughs> That's actually cute. Spider-Man, that's the first clue. Mind flipping it? Oh, okay. <gasps> oh, 
Okay. Looks like I'm going this way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what is this? Aw, that's the movie we saw when we had our first kiss. Oh, you're gonna need me to do this. Okay, hang on. All. <sighs> but still, best kiss ever. Spider-Man, the poster is stuck. Okay, can I give it a tug? Sure. Do I have to reach it from there or like? Vijay must be in the quad. Time for the big reveal. Find a seat, grab some popcorn. Vijay? This whole thing has you written all over it. I've always known you're a special guy. And I'm lucky you're my special guy. Aww. I love you, Lucas. Oh, that's so cute! You... What the hell? Will you? Ah. Uh, <gasps> no. Ah, uh, not exactly. Wait, wait, wait. Let me fix it. Let me fix it. Oh, no. Got to be something I can do to help here. Uh. Faulty power I need to Use my chain lightning. <laughs> Homecoming. <laughs> oh, I feel like that would break the TV. Matching sequin placers? Hell yeah! Phew, that was close. <laughs> Spider Man! Come down so I can thank you properly! <laughs> thank you for making this possible. Holy crap! You really got Spider Man in on this? Best day ever. Anything for love, guys. Happy for you both. Enjoy homecoming. <laughs> That's so adorable. <laughs> this freaking game. Okay, that was one down. City seems pretty quiet. Still yeah. no sign of Lee. Or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. Oh, heal the world. What is he doing? <laughs> All right, Peter. Hey, Pete. You ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. Mm -hmm. It's DARPA level stuff. Yeah, whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader, some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Yeah. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job too. Let's hope. Oh, there it is. Emily May Foundation. Damn! Harry works quick! Oh, I was wondering what this place was. was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. Oh, here we go. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Holy crap, dude, he really went all out. But then Dad, again, it's Norman Pete Osborne, hasn't right? Decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. 
Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. All right, let's see what he's so going to show So the first thing us. I want to show you is downstairs. Okay. Harry, this place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. For real? She had things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? I diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission to heal the world. First, That's I good. Want to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. I Young don't. is doing this super cool research. Can someone on bees, explain? <laughs> or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Yes, Gene. I just checked in on Dan and Anna. That data is not cross tabulate with the AI learning that in the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? Sure. Cool. You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline. That is true. That's Harry actually true in real life. Predator, the carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Bee drone? Whoa! This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see Whoa. those little holographic bee wolves? The better yeah. you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away. That's pretty cool. Oh, nice. Yes. Yep. Oh, yeah. Gotta protect the hive. Nice. Gotcha. <laughs> you know, Peter, a very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. I think I'm getting the hang of this. I knew you'd be good at this. <laughs> What's with everybody in the puns in this if game? Those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real. You'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. That's I'd a lot. i help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. I like how enthusiastic Harry is, Miles. Hey, now, do you have a sec? Uh-oh. We're doing cutting-edge Call you in a bit. Work. Using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. What is that? Huh. <laughs> Harry, a moment if you please. Uh, any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Dr. Peter, Connors. Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> no, nope. I've never been better. Impulsive thoughts? That's the thing that kind of gets me. <laughs> nice I'm to wondering. See you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. 
Oh, shoot. Wait, wasn't Dr. Connors on Craven's list? So that was crazy. Uh-oh. <laughs> and it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. I mean, Guess yeah, I'll he's, look around. he's fine when he's not the lizard. Cool, what's this? This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. Oh. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. Hmm. Norman Osborn? Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Probably. Let's see what else we have. I love this. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non biological Okay, are we gonna go into like venom territory here, right? Meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. Hmm. What else can I look at? This is a reminder that Dr. Kong's working move will begin in 15 minutes. Thank you. Have you been out to the Hudson Valley? So much to see here. Where do I even start? That's what I'm asking. Beehives show complex group decision making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emily May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. Okay, what about this? Drones. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultralight drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Hmm. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Okay. Did you do the XRF analysis? Ooh, bikes. Let me look at this. Hey. What are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now. But when they're road ready, <laughs> you know what's funny? I, I kind of wish that we did get a bike for when they were back. riding bikes earlier in the last episode. But I guess Harry was trying to be all nostalgic. Alright, let's go see Harry. The hell is that? Like ten percent of your paycheck. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. I know Peter wants to Where say yes. Now? Up to the top floor. He really wants to your say yes. He seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Now, do you I may know have some hang good on? new intel. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gribor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Okay. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. What fish? Oh, you have to. It's oh, it's probably that pond down there. Spots the Damn it. <laughs> so calming, and that we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. The algorithm is similar to long division. Uh, if you Dr. Like Foster. Got it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for understanding. See you soon. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, 
Peter, I presume. Hi. And Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize mm. optimal qualities. For instance, yeah. a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match Wait. the base pairs. Oh, I get it. Hang on. Can I turn them? You can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Wait, let me reset it. Let me reset it. Hang on, hang on. Let's there we see. go. Okay, I think I get they the have a lot. Oh right? my gosh, okay. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. So this needs Corporations to go there. patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. Huh. This is what everything that Harry wants to do. Right? So far, everything looks right. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on. But could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Hmm. Okay, so this needs to be like here? Well, that doesn't work. Let me reset it. Okay, I need one sun. One sun. One plant. It's just like problem solving is what it is. What about this? Beautiful there we work, go. Peter. Perfect! I did it! Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Damn! Oh. Hm. I knew a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. Uh, so now we're... Last stop. Okay. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show-offy. Okay, Harry, Your you're office. just throwing a lot of words. Uh, our office. Oh. Harry, now remember, <laughs> the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. I do okay. love that he wants him come to on. decide for Where's himself, because like his dad was like, "Oh, get in. how come he didn't uh, join we, in?" Put it. They don't tell me you lost. No, nope. did false alarm. Oh, okay. Right here. I was about to say, "Come on, dude." <laughs> Is this our office? Yo, that's kind of a nice. <laughs> There's a pinball machine. I swipe. Okay. That's a cool office. Wow. Oh, you're gonna be 
me cry again. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, God, there's so much more that we can do. Yeah, the problem is he doesn't I mean, want to let Harry down because he's Spider-Man. That's the problem. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and May proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? <laughs> I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> Aw, this is so cute! I'm so happy for them! Oh. One quick thing. <laughs> Yay! It's adorable. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Hey, Aunt May said that. But Coney Island later, yeah? <laughs> you bet. Oh my god, this is why I'm nervous, nervous to see what comes up with these two. But that's so nice of Harry to like have all of that for Peter, you know? He's honestly oh, such a great hey, friend. I forgot to tell you, some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. Cool, I've damn, there's the so much like side stuff I can bathrooms. do. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... It's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. Mm -hmm. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but... Duty calls. He keeps Trust ignoring me. it! Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Okay, guys. I'm gonna end this episode here. So, uh, congratulations to Peter. He finally got a job with his best friend. But now, he's gonna have to try to balance Spider-Man in his real life. Which is gonna be very interesting. And then also on Miles' end, he's, he's just, like, procrastinating. I think he's just scared. You know, which I don't believe him. It's pretty intimidating. Especially him, him trying to be his own person. Because I feel like he sees himself in the shadow of Peter anyway, as Spider-Man. But regardless of that, they have a lead on where Lee and Scorpion could have been taken. So hopefully we'll figure that out and it'll be less messy because, like I said, uh, Craven has a really long list of people he wants to take. So I have a feeling he's probably going to get somebody else in the meantime. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this episode of Spider-Man 2, remember to leave a like. Please let me know in the comments what you think and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button for more episodes of Spider-Man 2. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!